how much people literally do not want to focus on God, but want to focus on everything else. It's insane. It's crazy. People want to focus on way too much. So, this K Kyub, Kyub, Senate dude, he's like one of the most famous streamers in the world. He decided to throw like something down in New York City where he was going to say he's going to give out thousands of, or not thousands, but like PS5s, Playstations, gaming consoles, you know, stuff like that. And he said he's going to give that stuff away. So, like, and you know, just a few things. But thousands of people showed up. And this, look how crazy, look how crazy it was getting. I can't show, look at this. We have people dancing and tearing up cars and going nuts because thousands of people throwing. What? Like, what? Hold on. What a baby bed? I'll tell you, the things people will go. Places people will go. Oh, good night, look at the people. <sighs> My word. Hmm. Oh, gosh. Like, what? What in any way? Why? And apparently, he didn't even have like, what's that? What's that called? Like, um, like a card or something like that. Like he he never was even given permission to be able to do this. He didn't have a license to do it. So we have thousands of people show up for this, and he didn't have a license to do it. Thousands of people show up for that, and he didn't even have a license. It's ridiculous. It's utterly ridiculous. Let's see. Let, let's see. This let's talk about them. Tonight, charges filed against a social media star for allegedly sparking a massive riot in Manhattan's Union Square. 65, 65 arrests, arrests and multiple, multiple injuries. injuries. And you may be saying, Ethan, what? How does this have anything to do with God? Just this, this keep white. They threw cones, they threw chairs. Police charged influencer Kai Sanat with inciting a riot and unlawful assembly. He avoided the spotlight while being released from custody. Everybody from the world there. Yeah, the yeah, war you right right created, man. Like, come on now. You the one that decided that. For the first time, we're seeing how the event unfolded for Sanat. Where the park at? In a live stream of his arrival in Union Square. Where it was police that had to save him from the very mess he created. You have to pull up. Two days before the incident, he posted online that he was going to be holding a giveaway. We gonna ask y'all random questions, bro. Gonna have if to um, right, mark that out, but I'm sorry. Right. Ah, just like that. A promise of gaming consoles, gear, and one hundred dollar gift cards. All MTA trains and all that. I know you Oh, I'm turning my bleeper. Okay. Goodness, man. So clear your schedules. Sanat posting this to his six and a half million followers on Twitch, a live streaming service. That one of the biggest gamers, streamers in the world well. decided to say that. How can you, why would you do that? Why would you do that? There's millions of millions of people watching you say, hey, it's coming to New York, we're giving away stuff. And you have thousands of thousands of people. Across all social media. The NYPD saying the crowds, made up of mostly underage kids, went from unruly to violent fast. They destroyed mm. food carts. They destroyed uh, stores. Street artist Franklin Casera says he was too close for comfort. I saw people fighting around me. I saw two guys pushing. They went, they went down my stop. So I was really scared. Leaving a cyber celebrity. See, that's the problem. They're... Tearing up people's businesses, and they can't do nothing about it because you have thousands of people or hundreds of people coming in up in your business. You can't do nothing about it. You can't do anything about that. There's too many people coming up in there. Now in the spotlight for One all person. the wrong reasons. George joins me now from Union Square Park in New York. George, are we hearing anything from the social media star? Jose Sanat's reps say they are cooperating fully with authorities. In a statement they just released, they say they are disheartened by the disorderly conduct and they do not condone the behavior. Jose? Mm. Okay. 
people need to be focused on God. That's where it comes in. Just think. All those thousands of thousands of people. Probably a million people, honestly. Honestly. Probably not that many, but still. Think. 900,000 people. Over there. Probably over exaggerated. But still. Think about that if there was like a church event. There would not be that many people there. But to get stuff. Stuff that you can't take with you when you die. Stuff. There's that many people there. I just wish that many people would focus... Would just come in there just to, you know, to go to a church event, you know, go go get your life changed. See, I so have one more video. It's talking about everybody there. Pure chaos rocked the streets of Manhattan. People, uh, the reason they're on this car, they're like, what are they even doing? All right, so. There was this car that they supposedly thought the the Kai guy was in. And so people started just jumping on this car. And they were literally riding on this car as the guy was right or He wasn't in there, but it was I thought. And he was driving on the road. And people were falling off. Like, look at that. People were falling off this car. Attempted to have a mass meetup and giveaway at Union Square. Thousands of attendees swarmed the streets hoping to win gaming consoles and the like. And it got so out of control that the New York Police Department had to activate a level four response. Its highest level of disaster response. The chaos led to subway and street closures and eventually a standoff mm. with police and a riot in the streets as the crowds were forced to disperse. People were seen bleeding from their heads, having panic and asthma attacks with many attendees and police officers injured and the police say they have Kai in custody and said he'd been removed from the area for his safety also adding that they had a city bus mm. full of arrestees but no count on how many people were in custody and while Senate has a city but you know how big a, you know how big a city bus is people are getting out of control yet, for a bunch of stuff did say they were working with their legal team and might pursue charges of inciting a riot utter insanity and no doubt Kai had the best of intentions but what do you think happened here Okay, now the people are Just think about that for a minute. Think about how all we all we gotta do. All we gotta do is Those people are over here God. fighting over this stuff. Think that this is stuff that you can't take with you when you die. It's all just stuff. It's just stuff. And they're fighting, they're rioting. And the good, and they're crazy. Dude, they're seeking this. They're seeking all this, these things that that mean mean nothing. They're seeking these things that mean nothing. I'm sorry, that hurt your feelings, but this means that you cannot take it with you when you die. You cannot take it anywhere. You need to be seeking God. God says, "You will seek me and find me when you when you seek me with all your heart." Yes, yeah, so I just read that out of the Bible. You will. He said, "He said you will seek me and find me." You will, you will seek me and find me when you seek with all your heart. All your heart. And do your best to present yourself to God's one approved. Seek God. Not the world. Not the world of these things. Seek God. That's what we need. And stop worrying about all this stuff and just seek God. Seek God. Always. Once you do that, just remember. If somebody says, because he calls those giant riots for nothing. Just for some PS5s. Whoa. That thing's still playing over here. But, just think about that. For just one minute. Just follow, just follow God. Seek God. Not the worldly things. Seek God. Seek God. Like, subscribe. Um, if you haven't already, thanks for watching this video. Um, yeah, like I said, like, subscribe if you haven't already. Share the video with a friend, and see y'all next time. I'm out.